as you read this letter. This is one of my favorite Red Smiley licks, and I think it's one of the best he ever did. Um, I always call this the Love Please Come Home lick because that's the first tune I ever heard him do this in. And I remember the first time I heard him do it, I thought it was the greatest thing I'd ever heard. Uh, it really blew my mind, and I still love this lick. I do it all the time, and if I'm playing with somebody and they're playing the guitar for me and they hit this lick, it really brings a smile to my face every time. And um, you don't have to just do it in Love, Please Come Home. I think that uh, Red also did this in Nine Pound Hammer. Um, you can really do this in any tune that goes from a G to a D and back to a G, which is a lot of tunes, so um, it's a good one to know. Let's give it a listen to and see what it sounds like. Let me play that slow. All right, let's see if we can dissect this thing here. So what we're doing is we're moving from a G to a D and back to a G. That's all we're really uh, transitioning to. Um, and we're just walking through that chord change. Um, we're already in a G chord, so you should already have this G mashed down. So you're, you'd be mashing down the 3rd fret on your 6th string and your 2nd uh, fret on your 5th string. So you'd hit those two notes. We're going to rake right down those two notes. Real quick, like. Alright, so we end up on that 2nd fret on your 5th string. And we're going to walk that up to the 3rd and to the 4th. Then you're going to hit your 4th string open, then your 2nd fret on your 4th string, to your 3rd fret, to your 2nd fret, and then your 4th string open, and then back to your G chord, we're going to hit that 3rd fret on your 6th string. So it'll sound like this. Phrasing is key here, so like I said, you're you're hitting those first two notes really quick, and you kind of pause on that second note. You pause a little bit there. All right. So the phrasing is is really key to that lick. All right. And then we're going to follow it up with a a little G run here. Um, we're going to hit the A string, your 5th string open, and your 1st fret on your A string. So you end up with that G, and then we're going to hammer on to the 2nd th uh, fret. Let me play that a little better for you. Hard to slow it down. <laughs> So I'm hammering on to that 2nd fret on your 5th string. And then we're going to hit your 4th string open. And then your 2nd fret on your 4th string. And then we're going to hit your 4th string open again. And then your G string open, your 3rd string open. I think I explained that right. <laughs> Let me see. do that again. So the whole thing would be